Well, on allegation number two, yes. are you aware that in the national quality, where is the document? The national Quality Control Laboratory, this was documented on newspapers that revealed this in brackets scandal that about 18.2 billion was paid irregularly to ghost companies or individuals. And just to excite your memory, the payments went to Silicon Limited Chemicals, 2.5 or so million shillings, Wondergate Supplies Limited, 4.476 million shillings, Custard Traders Chemical Reagents, 2 point something million shillings, Airlight Business Solutions, 2.03 million shillings, Sardine Merchants Chemical Reagents, 2.6 something million shillings, Online Technologies, 1.8 something million shillings, Springline Agencies Limited, about uh, nearly 1 million. I've not given you the exact figures, but just to exact your memory, uh, the allegations that uh, 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 false raising of uh, IE uh, was done in the ministry and the payments actually done. What can you say about it? Oh, thank you, Chair. As far as that matter is concerned, uh, the information I have was that matter was brought to my attention. That the, is the fact is that the, the vouchers were never paid, uh, that uh, the payment was uh, intercepted. And they did ask for, for, for further review of, of those purchases. So there was no payment as far as our records are concerned. So it is true that some fictitious claims had been made to the Ministry for false payments? What I'd asked for, I'd asked for doubt. Anytime there's a doubt about something, we usually stop it mm -hmm. and then I dig down for, for details. Chair. Yes, Madam. Uh, thank you, Chair. Uh, you told us that um, the report could have, uh, audit report was leaked before it was completed. I want to ask you for your 